11 students and teachers are trying to come up with a backup plan after the Cambridge Matignon School announced its closing. WBZ's Julie McDonald explains why the private Catholic school that's been open for 75 years is shutting down. The crushing announcement for the Cambridge Matignon School community came after school on Tuesday. These last weeks of the year will be the final chapter in the Catholic high school's more than 75 year history. The way we all found out in an email was crazy to me, especially the juniors who are just about to reach their senior year and now they have to separate to go to different schools. That's awful. Those juniors, a class whose high school experience has had no shortage of change and uncertainty. Their freshman year was in the midst of COVID. You know, we they came into school with all these new people that could barely we could barely even make friends. We could barely even get close to each other. So now their senior year is going to get stripped away from them. Matignon students join many other local Catholic families scrambling to come up with a plan for September. St. Joseph Prep Boston, Mount Alvernia in Newton, and Bishop Conley in Fall River have all announced this school I year is the last. It's kind of hard just because it's so close to the end of the school year and the beginning of our junior year starts next year. So we just, we're still trying to figure it out, but it's very stressful. As underclassmen struggle to imagine graduating elsewhere. Before coming to Matinon, Matinon was like my dream school and I've always wanted to be here. Seniors are heartbroken. They can never come back. It felt like home to me. I just always felt like I belonged here. The school promises more information in the coming days and weeks, but says it will support underclassmen with their options throughout this transition. In Cambridge, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.